I'm Jason Roselle. You're watching Get Inspired with Jason. You ever meet those people that just creep you out, not just because of the way they may look aesthetically, which I never judge, and we should never judge, but the vibe, right? That vibe that you're like, get me away from this person right now. Yeah, let me tell you, that's called your wavelength, your energy inside that is not matching with something or someone else. Ever since I was really young, I was super intuitive before I became a life coach, wellness coach, relationship coach, and I always felt energies. I thought it was me and I actually looked into it. I looked into my personality type. I looked into my horoscope sign, which by the way, I'm Pisces single and no, I'm just joking. No, but seriously, I started really studying myself and saying, wait, is it me that I'm picking up? And I actually found out Pisces are super intuitive, but we all are super intuitive. But one thing we should never fail to do, and this is one of the biggest tips I tell all my clients is trust your gut. I mean it, if you are walking somewhere and you're just meeting someone, you're shaking hands, and you ever shook someone's hand and you're just like, whoa, you just got this weird premonition, this weird energy, follow your gut. Because in life, it's way too short for you to worry about, hey, should I do this, should I not? It's not being paranoid, your gut never fails. And sometimes we overthink, should I, should I not? Trust yourself. Your, that feeling you get in your stomach is the most important feeling you should ever ask for. You do not need validation from anyone. I believe that if someone gives you bad, weird energy, let that be the sign from the universe for you to peacefully remove yourself from the situation. And if you're asking, well, how do I remove myself from a situation where I'm kind of stuck, whether it's an office or what if it's my coworker, my boss, the girl that I'm dating. I hate to say it, but uh, it's time to cut off the string. It's simply that easy. And you're saying, no, there's complications. If you have particular questions, send me some comments or direct messages because I want to help you. But you got to remember, you owe it to yourself to love yourself more than anything or anyone else. Number two, respect yourself enough to walk away from anything or anyone that does not serve you any higher. And number three, respect yourself that's it too many times i would say a good 40 percent of the one-on-one -on -one coaching calls that i do with people across the united states and latin america and europe they always bring up this subject and i wanted to bring it up on this youtube episode because trusting your gut is something that you have to connect with do not overthink it just really go with it guys just know that you are right inside and if you're wrong, hey, look, no one's perfect. From time to time, it's okay. But nine out of 10 times, your gut, how you feel in your heart, right? Or I'll give you an example. I'm a happy hyper guy, right? I used to define that as anxiety. Ugh, I hate that word, right? No, I've learned to love that. And if you ever deal with anxiety or someone makes you uneasy, walking on eggshells, and I've talked about this in different episodes, remove yourself no matter how much deeply you are in love with them how much you love the job some things are not worth your peace believe me when i tell you no it's not you got one life baby you cannot worry about xyz or certain things that are not making you happy i yeah yeah forget about it get inspired go have a great day Make sure to subscribe to my channel if you're a new viewer and don't forget to click on the bell so you can get notifications every time a new show releases. If you enjoyed this video, give it a like and feel free to leave your comments. I'm Jason Roselle and you're watching Get Inspired with Jason.